into data types of C. Data types of C language. Actually, what do you mean by data type? So, data type is going to describe some properties like so which kind of information that particular language supports and the min and maximum values are supported by the type so the amount of space required for the variable okay so these three properties are described by data type first one the type of value the type of value the type of value a mm, language supports second one what is the max and min values max and min values max and min values of the type next one the amount of space the amount of space required the amount of space required for the type first one once again i will explain just you look at the points so the data type is going to describe the type of value a language a language means the type supports and what is the max and min values of the type so instead of language you can specify a type type of value it supports okay so what is the max and min values of, of the type and how much memory is required for the type so these three properties are described by data type of a language so as far as the c language is concerned here yeah, we are going to have like <coughs> mainly they are divided into these categories what is the first type first one is predefined types predefined means so all predefined types are defined by c language developer developers means they comes with c language software second category is user defined user defined types so what are the predefined types i will explain so under first category predefined category predefined category we have types like <coughs> mainly they are divided into numeric non numeric non numeric type so under numeric type again we have integral or integer type integer and floating point numbers floats floating point and under integer we can have int and long under floating point numbers we can have what float and double float and double so under non numeric category we can have what characters so there is no string in c language character uh, comes under non numeric type so under numeric category mainly we are going to have two types integers and floating point numbers so under uh, 
uh, integer int long under floating point numbers we, we are going to have float and double so under non numeric category we are going to have only character type so this is about predefined types so under uh, <coughs> user defined types so all user defined types are defined by normal developers so they are not uh, developed by c language developer so they are they have to be defined by developers so the user defined types so what are the user defined types normally in c language we are going to have uh, one user defined called structure structure okay so this is a user defined type so the c language does not does not support classes concepts only structures are there in c language so which comes under user defined category okay so when uh, coming to <coughs> so integer type numeric type and non numeric type we are going to have what integer int long float and double so these are data types okay so the what is the general criteria so integer is going to store what only integers like uh, uh, which does not have any fraction part okay like total marks and uh, marks 1 marks 2 various subjects marks like hall ticket number okay so uh, id card id number so such type of information does not have any fraction part to store to store such kind of information we may use integer okay so and what is the long so long is also for storing what integer kind numbers integer type of numbers but so if the range is not sufficient so actually the range of uh, integer is minus 32768 to plus 32767 okay so this is the range minus 32768 to plus 32767 that means if the value to be stored is lesser than this one higher than this one we have to go for long we have to go for long and uh, float and double what is the difference here float and double both are for storing what floating point numbers means uh, the numbers which uh, have uh, fractional part like average marks percentage oh so for such kind of information we can use float and double so what is the difference between float and double so float is going to occupy some less space double is going to occupy more space because according to space requirement space occupation W is W is going to generate more number of decimal places, and what is character? So character again, it is especially for storing characters. Means uh, just like uh, co the color codes, co marital marital statue. Okay, so for storing that kind of information, we may use character category. <coughs> so when coming to user defined types, so structures. So structure means. Uh, so we we are going to define our own uh, uh, types using structure concepts so when topic comes i will explain it very clearly okay so this is a uh, story regarding data types of c language